no doubt the entire police force in Odiolowo Juwoye OCDA have played significant roles in the sustained peace and harmony residents have enjoyed over the years. To invigorate them further and keep them motivated in the discharge of their functions, the leadership of Odiolowo Juwoye OCDA paid a courtesy visit to the four police divisions in the community, which are Area D Police Command, Olosan Police Division, Alakara Police Division, and Ilupeji Police Division. The police officers across the divisions were promised robust unitized packages. Divisional police officers commended the leadership's efforts to advance the goals of the police, describing their working relationship as cordial and productive. The Council Chairman Vazak Ajala said the visit underscores the leadership's acknowledgement of police efforts to sustain peace, citing instances of their proactiveness to due responsibilities. For you to know that, we know that we tell you there is no way we will have to charge our constitutional responsibility of protecting life and properties. That we are enjoying relative peace within and beyond this division. It was made possible because of the excellent and effective services that the looking to police officers are providing for the benefit of our people. Police officers also said the visit and the Christmas largesse will boost the morale of the police officers to discharge their responsibilities more effectively. This is actually not the first, so um, he has promised before, I call him a man of uh, talk and do, he has promised before, he made deal with it, now that he has said he will, I, am, I have no doubt that he will. The officers and I are all excited and we are waiting to receive. This is just unprecedented, I'm so happy. Uh, this is the kind of synergy we talk about when the executive chairman comes on a visit and to give us a very special Christmas gift. I'm so happy and uh, it's poor my men to do more for the local government. I'm so happy. He's a wonderful man. He did it last year and he has promised to do it this year. He's a wonderful man. He's a man of grassroots. We appreciate what he's doing in this community. He's a man of people and he has demonstrated that with police. So we, we, what we can only say is to continue to pray for him. The Almighty God will elevate him higher than this in the name of Jesus. They will double their efforts. They will do more than, like the chairman said, I want to reiterate, um, to whom much is given, much is expected. The encouragement that we've gotten, we will definitely double up our efforts and be more proactive than reactive. That's a promise. Ajela said the court's visit and largest provided underscores his administration's commitment to the welfare of police in the LCDA, admonishing them to continue to secure lives and properties. Of course, we expect them to continue to give us better and more effective policing so that our people, including my humble self, would be able to sleep with our two eyes closed. He urged residents to celebrate the Yuletide season in line with the ambit of the law. My appeal to them is that they should be orderly and moderate in celebrating uh, all the activities during this season. They should be law abiding. They should show all social activities that will put them in negative light before the members of the public. The police force in New Jolowe Ujui is primed to sustain law and order in the community. As the Christmas season begins, the leadership of Ujolowe Ujui Christian chapter organized an end of the year and Christmas carol service. The service held at the council premises where members of the Christian Fellowship and Council officials engaged in a prayer and praise session to invoke divine presence. Speaking at the carol service, the council manager, Otonaike Folake, said the season is a period to reflect on God's protection and guidance in the course of the year, as she urged people to be God-fearing and good residents. My advice to everybody is that we should celebrate for the fear of God. We should be security conscious and also think of all the less privileged and see how we can help them out, support them in every way, make them happy. Any, uh, anywhere we come across the less privileged, the widows, the uh, physically challenged and uh, many of us are the aged and so on and so forth. We should do our best to stress, uh, extend our hands of fellowship to them and make them happy. Members of the fellowship also called on more people to inculcate the tenets of Christianity. 
as the theme specifically speaks, thus far the Lord has helped us. Uh, my message for the staff and the generality of the people is that they should see God, serve God, commit themselves unto God, because according to that theme, we are recognizing and appreciating what God has done for us from the beginning of the year up until today. The Ojiolu Ojiwe Christian Fellowship at the spiritually enriching session with a sense of gratitude and appreciation to the Almighty. Thank you.